Introduction to the Internet Learning the uses of the internet with the internet terminology Hey kids! We have seen what a useful machine the computer is and how it has revolutionized our life in all areas. But the real power of the computer is seen when computers are connected to each other. When two or more computers are connected to each other by cables or by using another technology, they form a network. Computers in a network can communicate with each other. This means that persons using computers on a network can share information. They can also share resources like software and hardware devices. The Internet Most of you must have heard about the Internet. Many of you might also have used or seen the Internet being used for searching information on a topic for news or for sending emails etc. Let us learn some more about the internet. The internet is a global that is worldwide network of computers. It has been formed by the joining of many smaller networks to form one large network. The internet has millions of users all over the world. How are so many computers connected? The internet uses special cables, telephone links, satellites, microwaves or another devices to connect millions of computers across the world to each other. What can you do on the internet? The internet provides many services to its users. We can only list a few here provides unlimited information. The internet is a storehouse of information on any topic. Using the World Wide Web that is www, we can get access to videos, games, songs, textual matter, graphics, images and even movies on most topics. Means of Communication we can communicate with other person through the internet by sending emails, by chat programs and by putting up websites. Shopping. We can even buy and sell things on the internet. Employment. We can look for jobs in the internet. Reservations. We can book train or airline tickets. Plan a holiday. We can plan holidays by visiting tourism related websites. Music We can get the latest music by visiting musical related websites. Online education There are many distance education sites which provide online education on various subjects. We can download various softwares. Internet terms World Wide Web www. The World Wide Web refers to millions of documents on the internet which are linked to each other just like a spider's web. It is the www which makes the internet so user friendly that even children can use it. Web page The web page is a document on the World Wide Web a web page is written in a computer language called Hypertext Markup Language or HTML. Web pages are connected to each other by linked words called hyperlinks. When we click on a hyperlink, we get linked to another web page or image or songs or even a movie. This is how the World Wide Web is formed. Website A collection of web pages related to each other by a certain topic is known as a website. Just like a collection of pages on one topic makes a book, a collection on web pages makes a website. A website is created by an organization 
or a person to give information about a particular topic, person, product or organization. For example, you could be having a school website, a website for an Indian railway, etc. Net surfing Moving from one website to another on the net, short for internet, is known as net surfing. Home page A home page is the first page you see when you enter a website. A home page usually has links to the another web pages of the website. URL Uniform Resource Locator Every house on your street has a house number which makes it easy to locate the house. Similarly, each website or web page has an address which is called its URL or Uniform Resource Locator. For example, google.com, myschool.edu.etc. Web Browser The web browser is a software required to be installed on your computer to use the internet. The web browser allows you to read the web pages on the www. The Windows operating system has Internet Explorer as its browser. Using the Internet Explorer, you can read pages written in HTML. Summary We have learned about the uses of Internet with the Internet terminology. That's all in this lesson. Keep learning student and do use internet.